Hello guys, uh, first of all sorry for being out of my channel for so long, I was busy upgrading my virtual machine and um, my website, but now I am back with a new removal tutorial for this best show at Wear uh, that is uh, mainly distributed uh, through CNET, uh, so, so called CNET downloader, I can show you it in a second. When you download uh, software from CNET, uh, it uh, runs a so-called CNET downloader uh, in which it shows you uh, advertising uh, offers. Uh, you can accept or decline them. Here you can see past show ad. Uh, adware will be installed along with uh, DriverMax software I decided to download recently. Uh, it could be any software actually. So I will stop this installation and we will see what we will have uh, in browsers after past show is installed. So it is an extension installed in Firefox and Internet Explorer and sometimes in Google Chrome. And when you run the web, uh, past show uh, show you extra advertising on various websites. For example, this is my website. Uh, which is clean, uh, but it adds extra banners and underlined text uh, and uh, makes uh, web browsing really a night nightmare because uh, it slows down uh, surfing a lot. Here you can see these banners and these links. I don't have them on my website. This is added by this extension in Firefox. So I will close uh, the browser, you can see the pop-up. Uh -huh. So, um, but this is not the main uh, issue with the past show. Uh, I suppose you can uninstall it from your control panel, but in my case, as I see it, I cannot do this. But first of all, I would like to show you my tests. I scan, scan my system with uh, three anti-malware products. This is Spy Hunter, Stronghold anti-malware, uh, and Malware Bytes. And they both found, uh, they all found uh, this uh, adware. Uh, Stronghold anti-malware is a new product. It has toolbar removal feature. And the leader was Spy Hunter. It found most of registry keys and files of past show. Uh, strong malware the second and uh, malware bytes into malware the third one. Uh, you can use them to remove this adware because, as I said, I was not able to install it through control panel. Uh, I will show you the error I get in a second. Here are the results of these three anti malware products. So when I go to control panel and try to uninstall past show, it shows me access denied error or insufficient access. So it's really no alternative to remove past show when you have such error, because I am an administrator and I do not have rights to remove past show. This is quite weird. So I use. Uh, all three products to clean my system one by one. Strong content malware. You can use one of them. I recommend Spy Hunter because it found 21 uh, item uh, and other found less. And after this, uh, you can reboot your system, or in my case, I will not reboot, just check uh, what I have left in Firefox. So I will open the Firefox. And I go to add-ons. As you see, no add-ons, but let's see uh, how uh, websites are opening. I go to my blog, and as you, as you can see, it loads much faster without any extra advertising, just I don't use 
uh, Google AdSense or anything like this on my website. So and to double check I will use Avest Browser Cleanup. I will give you all the links of this software in the description. So Avest is analyzing my system and it shows no best show whatsoever. Thanks for watching, I will be soon with new tutorials.